Hello to all of you, I hope you are all well and have a good time. Welcome to another The Fixed Focus programs. In this program, I would like to discuss another ability of the Fixed Focus system. For those people who are newcomers, I must say that we have a system called Fixed Focus. In the Fixed Focus system that you can see now, this copper spiral tube is in focus and the oil passes through it and we transfer the hot oil to the place we need, and now I have removed it from its place. Now we want to convert the Fixed Focus system into a solar cooking stove. There are different methods of cooking with a solar dish, examples of which you can see in these photos and videos. But in the fixed focus system, cooking is much easier, and since the focus is fixed, we will no longer need to adjust the solar dish, and the rotation of the solar dish is completely automatic. And this system is very efficient for areas where there is no access to fuel and electricity. But the problem with a proper cooking with a solar dish in this system is that the focused light often hits one side of the cooking dish. I put a cooking dish on the focus of the system and I'll move the camera closer so you'll see what I mean. Now you can see that the light hits the metal container from one side. And on the other hand, the container sees less heat. To fix this problem, I have used a very low consumption DC motor. And I have mounted a stand to place the baking dish on this engine. And I have connected its power supply to a 10 watt panel, of course, along with an on, off switch. By pressing the key, it is turned on and the dish rotates at a suitable speed. This will make the entire part of the metal container heat up equally. Now you can see that if I cast a shadow on the solar panel the motor will stop moving. So we can easily do this with a slow speed gearbox engine. Of course, the installation of this method should be such that the heat does not reach the DC motor. Now I want to do the easiest cooking, and that is to prepare fried eggs. Well, let's go to prepare a fried egg. Our dish is hot now. I pour oil first, of course, I think I poured too much. I pour the egg into the oil. You can calculate the cooking time from this moment. I don't change the speed of the video so you can see how long it takes to cook. The ambient air temperature here is now 19 degrees Celsius equivalent to 66 degrees Fahrenheit. 
Interestingly, no drop of oil is launched outside and this is because the proper heat reaches the oil. If the color of the dish was black, the cooking would be done faster. In this method, you don't need to be careful while cooking because all parts of the cooking vessel are heated equally. It took about 3 minutes to cook this fried egg. You saw how easy cooking can be done with a solar container of less than 1 square meter. Of course, this method is specific to the fixed focus system, in which the focus does not cause any disruption during cooking without any change. In this system, we are sure of the result of our work without the need to control the solar dish. If the sun is vertical, for example in tropical regions, in this case, the solar dish is placed horizontally, and there is no need to rotate the cooking dish anymore. Of course, in most areas, the sun does not shine vertically, and the system of rotating the cooking vessel is necessary. I have used a small container to prepare fried eggs but you can also use a large cooking pot. Well, I turned on the rotation switch. I moved the camera closer. This container is black and absorbs heat better and you can see the light hitting one side of a cooking pot. And the rotation of the pot causes the heat to be uniform in all its parts. Of course, I made this stand just to make this video, and in practice, a bearing should be used between the DC motor and the stand. And also the heat should not reach the DC motor. Of course, there is no news of the low consumption DC motor getting hot. DC motor with gearbox has a good output power and if you use bearings, it can even rotate a 20 kg weight. Unfortunately, my cooking is not very interesting and we don't have the opportunity to prepare food in this video either. Well, I hope this video was suitable for you. In the focus of this solar dish, proper heat is generated and heat transfer is easily transferred to the food pot. But in the method of conducting heat with the help of hot oil and using the oil spiral pipe, the loss of thermal energy will be high. Like when we cooked fried egg with hot oil transfer method in a video and it took more time due to energy loss. Therefore, the transfer of heat energy with hot oil must be done very carefully in order to have the least energy loss. Of course, with large solar dishes, energy loss can be compensated to some extent. Anyway, the fixed focus system can be used for various tasks and it can be said that it is a multi-purpose system. Thank you for being with me so far, until the next program, goodbye. I have opened the DC motor with the base in question. 
you can see how simple the base is made. And this is the same engine with a low consumption gearbox that works with this key. And this base is placed on the shaft of the DC motor in this way. And it should be tightened with a screwdriver. Now if I turn on the DC motor, you can see how easily it rotates. Of course, a bearing should be placed between the base and the motor so that vertical pressure does not apply to the electric motor shaft.